Hello ladies and gentlemen, Martin Gibbons here from the Pantaloon School of Shakespeare. Now, a lot of you have been asking recently for some homeschooling information about Shakespeare to help youngsters get to grips with the Bard's work while the schools are closed. Well, to get you started, here are our top nine Shakespeare facts. Shakespeare wrote most of his plays in iambic pentameter. This is a small village just outside of Coventry. To this day, it still has a post office. Macbeth is commonly referred to as the Scottish play. That's because there have never been any other plays ever set in Scotland. Shakespeare commonly uses the term nuncle. This refers to someone who is both your nephew and your uncle, something very common in Elizabethan England. The first 11 nights of Shakespeare's ambitious collection of plays have been lost to time, leaving only Twelfth Night, which makes very little sense on its own. Shakespeare's plays can be divided into comedies, tragedies or histories. Comedy in Shakespeare's day actually meant painfully unfunny. Hamlet is Shakespeare's only play where the main character is a dog. It's about a great Dane that goes mad, digs up a skull and kills everyone. He's sadly put down at the end like those other famous dogs, Old Yeller, Lassie and Snoopy. Shakespeare coined many famous words and phrases, including What the Dickens, Mum's the Word, and rather surprisingly the KFC slogan Finger Licking Good. A Midsummer Night's Dream is a cautionary tale about substance abuse and how its effects can lead to personality changes, incoherent shoutings of Minimuses of hindering knotgrass and sleeping with a donkey man. Kids, don't do love in idleness. And now for our top Shakespeare fact. Shakespeare was both born and died on St George's Day. This means that he wrote all of his plays on one day and as a newborn. What have you done today? And that's all from the Pantaloon School of Shakespeare for now. We'll see you next time. What do you mean there's not going to be a next time?